Round one of the 2020 EDGA Match Play Tournament from Whispering Woods, another gorgeous day of golf. Defending champion Drew Dimel facing Ryder Grignall in the first round. Dimel one up on the 13th green when he converts on the birdie try. The two would have holes 14 and 15, and then with a chance to clinch the match and advance, Dimel would step up yet again and deliver on another lengthy birdie putt. He advances to the second round with a 3-2 and two victory. It feels great. Um, the course is great. Give credit to Rich Rocky and his whole crew. He's playing very hard. It's nice to come out here and uh, start with competition we haven't seen in a while. Um, you know, Ryder Grignol, I played first. He's a uh, competitor. I call him uh, the grinder because he just he'll push you to the end. But uh, I give a lot of credit to him, and I was actually excited to play him because um, I knew his first score, you know, didn't match his golf game. So mm -hmm. he's a lot better player than that. More highlights from the first round. What a battle between Alex Weir and Zach Ford. The match is all square on the 18th green. Weir needs that par putt to extend the match, and he bombs it in. Then on the first playoff hole, Weir just needing to get this putt close, and he would defeat Ford one up on 19 holes. Jump back to the 13th hole. Ted Grassi facing Bob Nicotra, and Grassi. Going with a soft 8-iron from just over 130 yards out, puts his approach shot to within birdie range. And then from there, he would calmly knock it in. Grassy advances with a 4-2 and two final over Rob Nicotra. Over to the 14th, Isaiah Swan taking on Mike Newcomer. The Northeast standout has this tricky chip shot that almost goes in for birdie, just slips out. He would go on and advance with a 4-2 and two win. Another intriguing matchup featured Gannon golf coach Dustin Coleman battling his pupil Mark Majeski. Majeski opting to putt from the fringe, puts it to within a few inches of the cup. He defeated Coleman 3-2. and two. Back to the 14th, former champion Sean Scully has a lot of real estate to cover on this birdie attempt. But check out the great touch and judgment on the putt. He would tap in for par, advances to round number two by defeating Mike Wolf, four and two. So here are the second round pairings for Friday morning. Defending champion Drew Dimel faces Alex Weir. The highest seed in the other bracket, Zach Henry battles TJ Mitchell. The other top two seeds, John Marriott and Dave Spitzer, are in the Sweet 16 as well. Marriott meets Ted Grassi, and Spitzer tangles with Mark Majeski. By the end of Friday, the field will be trimmed down to the final four. The second round begins at 8 a.m.